We're here. Brodia Castle. I don't see any Illusion soldiers. Oh, thank goodness. The attack hasn't begun. Wait. There's someone in front of the gate. He doesn't look like a guard. Is it an enemy soldier? No. That's... That's Diamant! He must have come out to greet us! I've been waiting for you, Divine One. I greet you as the Crown Prince of Brodia. I'm Diamant. I've heard so much about you. I'm honored to finally meet the legend in person. It's a pleasure, Prince Diamant. And Prince Alfred, welcome. Queen Eve's letter explained your situation. Thanks for coming all this way. It's good to see you. Likewise. I'm sorry it took a war for us to meet again after all this time. Oh, and Alcrist. Thanks for escorting our guests from the border. I know that's a rugged road. It was nothing, really. I bear ill news, however. Illusion forces attacked us at the Grand Crossing. Is that right? A battalion led by Princess Hortensia. We fought her off, but she said something troubling. The Crown Princess intends to assault Brodia Castle. If they're after our emblem ring, we may be on course for a dangerous confrontation. We'll have to prepare our defenses. Thanks for the warning, Alchrist. Come. Father will want to hear about this. Why do you all look so tense? Father, you were supposed to be waiting inside. Yes. I know, and I was, but then I had this feeling my boy Alchrist might be home. Seems my fatherly intuition was right, as usual. <laughs> Welcome back, son. Thank you, father. I wish you'd stop finding excuses to leave the castle. It's not safe out here. Please, Diamant, not another lecture. Where's the harm in welcoming my dear boy back from his journey? Anyway, we'd best not argue in front of our guests. Oh. It's all right. Please, pardon my rudeness. Divine One, Prince Alfred, welcome. I am Morian, King of Brodia. Good to meet you. Likewise. I never imagined I'd meet the Divine Dragon. Indeed, such a special occasion calls for a welcoming duel. There's no time for that. We have an important matter to discuss. As all Christ was escorting our guests from the border, Illusion soldiers attacked them. <laughs> Illusions. It appears that the Crown Princess is planning an assault on Brodia Castle. Already making their move, huh? Soldiers, go now! Shore up our defenses! Yes, Your Majesty. Well done getting that information, Alchrist. Please, I don't deserve such kind words. Humble as ever, son. <laughs> King Morian, excuse me, but I need your kingdom's aid. You want our emblem ring, right? <laughs> I knew you'd ask. That's why I brought it. Here, the ring of the young lion. Hey, Diamant, think fast. Father, we're supposed to take care of the ring, not throw it around. Ah, you're no fun. Um, Alfred? Yes? King Morian seems so... nice. This is the man who's always invading Elusia? I thought he'd be more... intimidating. You're seeing Morian friend and family man. He's known to be a big-hearted guy. But in battle, the demon comes out. He's not someone you want as your enemy. Ugh. Father can be such a handful sometimes. Divine One. I've got the ring for you. Thank you. What will you do with it? I'm going to summon an emblem. Rise up, emblem of binding.
I'm Roy. If you're summoning me, that can only mean war has begun. There was a person in there? How about that? All along, this emblem dwelt in our family's ring. And now you have released him. It seems divine is no exaggeration, huh? Urgent news, Your Majesty. An illusion wyvern rider is approaching. It's dodging all our archers' attacks. What? She's here. Divine One, may I call upon Roy's help to defend the castle? Of course. Princess Ivy, speak for the Illusion Throne. I will now take your lives, your souls, and the rings. I underestimated how far you could get into Brodian territory, Princess Ivy. My soldiers are on the way. Now, I will give you a chance to surrender before they arrive. Oh, I'm itching for that fight. Father, go back to the castle. What? Why? If something happened to you, our country would be devastated. Please, leave this to us. Right. Why should the king get a say in the matter? I'll do as you ask. But, Diamant, Alchrist, don't you dare get killed. We won't. Uh, well... We'll try not to. You must be the Divine Dragon. That's right. You really are as stunning as my sister said. I'm pleased to meet you. As is my ring. But that's... The Ring of the Sage Lord. A gift from my father. With its power, I am sorry to say... I must kill you. I won't let that happen. It's you who will fall, Princess Ivy. You won't surrender, then? In that case, my forces will prepare for battle. As will ours. I'll stop at nothing to get those rings back. <sighs> Finally! Horsey, you stopped! Where were you taking me? Huh? Wait, uh... Is this the castle? Is that Prince Diamant? Amber? What are Illusion soldiers doing here? They've attacked us. Say, Amber, weren't you out fighting beasts? I was, but then Horsey got spooked and wouldn't listen to me. I kept getting tossed around on its back, and next thing I know, here I am. <laughs> I'll never understand how you end up in these strange situations. But this time, it works in our favor. I was just wishing you were here. Maybe Horsey sets this danger. That's so clever of you! Ready to defend the castle together? I was born ready! If our enemies reach the gate, the castle will be theirs. We can't allow that to happen! Let us be off. Together, we will defend the castle.
Here goes. Go ahead. I am ready to serve. Whatever you say. I'm ready for more. You got it. M me? Show me the way. For the Divine Dragon! Relent until the castle is ours. If these enemies all come at once, our defenses won't hold. Our castle has a ballista. We can use that to pick them off. Tell me where. Stand down or perish! Some help. I'll have to up my weights.
for the Divine Dragon! <laughs> the strength of the stewards! the divine dragon. That was a fierce battle.
My name is Kagetsu. Pleased to meet you. If only it were under friendlier circumstances. Emblem engage! So the rest it deserves. Be protected. Look what you made me do. <laughs> With this emblem's strength and my own, there will be no defeating me. Leave now, or my duty demands you be destroyed. Nothing personal. <laughs> Thank you. 
Another kill for me. hero. That would make a good legend, but it's not the one I want. I'd better retreat. Return to Princess Ivy. Covered the ring, but the emblem is tainted with fell dragon energy. I'll have to summon him again myself. Free us, emblem of genealogy. I am Leaf. Thank you for letting me swing a sword with these arms again. 
I will do what I can to retrieve that which has been stolen. Thank you, Leaf. How could I have failed? It's over, Princess Ivy. Surrender. I will not. There is more for me to do. No! Yeah. She's gone. Your Highness, urgent news from the border. What is it? An Aleutian battalion stands at the ready. King Hyacinth is acting as general. He's leading their army himself. What? Yes. And he is demanding to see King Morian. <sighs> I must face him. Anything less would bring dishonor to Brodia. Father, he's baiting you. This may be a trap of some kind. Go back inside. Ha! I can fight my way out of whatever trap he springs. I urge you to reconsider. Listen, who's the father and who's the son here? Stop trying to protect me. <laughs> son, this has been happening a lot lately. What's it all about? Are you worried Brodia might lose this war? Or lose its king? <sighs> We're not ready for any of this. Brodia to lose its king. Or me. My father. Diamond. From a young age, I was told I would lead Brodia after you died. Imagine, a boy forced to anticipate his father's death. To think of that empty throne. The Fell Dragon has returned. War is here. The future is uncertain. And I'm not ready. It's all right, Diamond. If I die, I die. Brodia will live on. But, father. What? You don't believe me? After I'm gone, I know you will lead with a steady hand. Though, I'm offended you expect that day to come so soon. You think I'm gonna lose, huh? You think I'm weak? That I need your protection? Oh, the hubris of youth. That's not what I meant. King Hyacinth awaits me on the field of war, his army at the ready. If Brodia hides, then what? After years locked in battle with Illusia, Will we reveal ourselves as cowards? Listen to me, Diamant. I will fight bravely for Brodia. I do not fear death. Being known as a king who runs from battle? That scares me far more. <sighs> what do you think about this, Alchrist? Me? If I die, and Diamant alongside me, you will take the throne. <sighs> Father, don't say that. I... I will not let that pass. I will protect Diamant to the bitter end. Alcrest. Ha <laughs> ha! That's my boy! Diamant, you could learn a thing or two from your brother. Fear has no place in my kingdom. If we step into fear, then we step out of Brodia. <sighs> now then, to the border! It seems I can't dissuade you from this path. All I can do is walk it with you. Come on, everyone! Let's show Illusia why we're called the Kingdom of Might. Ha <laughs> ha! That's it. This won't be the last time I see the castle. And when I'm back, a tournament with our strongest warriors. That means you, Divine One. Me? Yes. I want to see you transform into a mighty dragon. Whoosh! Roar! Oh. Well, okay. What's the matter? Ah, oh, nothing. You're right. I could turn into a dragon. <laughs> I'm looking forward to that. I'd like to spar with you too, Divine One, after a father gets his chance. But that's for later. Now, we should prepare for our journey to the border. Indeed. <sighs> this talk of turning into a dragon... Mother could. Can I? I have no idea if I can. Or how.
We'll return soon. I leave Brody a castle in the Royal Guard's capable hands. Yes, Your Majesty. You can count on us. Done a fine job protecting it all these years, haven't we? We won't start slacking off just because you're not around. Excellent. And when we return, you'll be treated to a victory feast. Looking forward to it. See you soon, Your Majesty. Strong of body! Strong of heart! All right. Time to head out. Here we go. They're wrapping up their goodbyes. Yes. Onto the border. <laughs>